healer, all I want to hear is that my mm. feelings have been validated, that you recognize what I'm experiencing yeah. in that moment. And I'm that's a struggle for me. You know. <laughs> yeah, because you think. I think I think thinkers struggle with empathy mm. because there's logic. Like it's like just figure this out. Versus when, yeah, you just want validation, you want empathy, you mm -hmm. want compassion. Yeah. And I, I will say and admit openly that as thinkers, that's a struggle and it's not as natural for us. Mm -hmm. And then as a thinker, you're like, okay, when you're married to a feeler, the feelers, it's it's nerve wracking because they do make decisions based off their, their feelings. Yes. And feelings come and go all the time. And that, that's scary and unnerving for a thinker. It's yeah. like, oh shoot, so you're feeling that you don't love me today? Later. Because Megan yeah. brings up the conflict in our relationship, yeah. I don't, I constantly feel attacked. Mm. And I'm trying to mitigate that. I'm trying to minimize as much conflict. Now, of course, some of that comes from just our own upbringing. Yeah. Megan was raised in a family that uh, nobody talked about the issues. So she was like, let's talk about it. Yeah. And I was in a family where there was so many divorces over conflict that I just... I was like, I don't want to deal with any conflict. Well, and it was interesting because Casey had said, because I was like, babe, tell me about flighters because that's not my personality. That's just never been me. And he goes, I actually get anxious. Like sometimes I get knots in my stomach thinking about having to face um, our issues yeah. because I just want to make sure we're happy. Mm. But then what I was trying to explain to him, though, is that they're never really dealt with. Right. Yeah. And so that's this right. is where. This so when you're dating. You're drawn to these differences. Yes. They're attractive because it balances you out. And frankly, you know, you don't have to work together as a team. Yeah. So the differences don't really get in the way. Yeah. It's almost like you're different and so you respect your differences, yeah. but you do focus more on your positives. And the when, things that you have in, in you know, in common. In common. And, and when you're dating, you're not like, hey, let's list out all the things we're different. No. You try to find the similarities. And the similarities exactly. are what you're focusing on. Then you say, I do. And you become <laughs> an official team, Team Casting. And that's when everything changes. Because <laughs> the novelty wears off. Of Working on your marriage does not have to be boring. If you want to build confidence in your life and have fun working on your marriage, become a member to Marriage 365. Get access to all of our videos, our marriage checkup, and all of our online courses.